Now, I don't know if anybody who is here today was here last time. Elizabeth, you were here. You are the perhaps the one person who remembers any of the things that were discussed in the last meeting of this metrics model working group. But when I was looking over it, I, I didn't know if there was anything to follow up with on the practitioner guides, but it, and Dawn's not here, but it did look like um, there might be some ongoing follow-up related to the ISO standards. Yes, and um, yeah. if we're going by my memory, that is incredibly frightening because my memory yeah. is not great. Um, I do know that there is a, an effort to create a Chatham House rules not recorded once um either once a month or twice a month i don't remember now um details of that are in slack i know divya has posted yeah. model slack so if that's something you're interested in joining um to specifically talk about this because i think the idea was to take this conversation about iso standards out of metrics models and put it in that specific meeting um so go into slack let divya know she'll add you to uh or something the invite something uh, uh, and i would assume that it needs to be not recorded because that somehow it might potentially accidentally violate chatham house rules or correct yeah and okay. um, i think there are folks that need to talk about this uh, more sensitively than others yeah well i can imagine that for yeah. sure just to be more inclusive um that's that's why I mean it's still open to whoever it just um, is not going to be recorded and and if you participate in that meeting, you will be asked to um, adhere to those rules and they'll explain what those mean. Um, in the in the meeting, but uh, just for those who don't know what that means, it means if you talk about whatever was discussed in the meeting you you should not or, or really cannot um, attribute it to a certain person so right. I could saying, hey, Sean said this thing in this meeting about this thing. It would right. be, like, this was a topic that was discussed at a meeting. And just Sean's name out of it um, and be a little more general. At least that's my understanding of the Chatham House rules. If that's incorrect, somebody correct me. Yeah, I'm not, a, I'm not an expert on it either. I, my understanding is it is to prevent competitive, you know, basically open, you know, basically to prevent collusion. Um, yeah, or collusion is the sharing of something but, sensitive that's to your right. you know, face or whatever and then um, it coming back to yeah if you have signed an nda or something like that where you can't share anything and but you need to talk about a something um that's yeah and now don is here so we can go back up to the first one if we would like to yeah is there um uh, Don, is there anything about um, the practitioner guides that you wanted to follow up on? You of course asked, but I just took like a gigantic bite of something because I'm having my. I acting. got a. <laughs> I, I, I I have. So well I have done. A way, I have a way of <laughs> of uh, nailing that kind of bad timing award. <laughs> Um, I don't have any specific updates on the practitioner. Well, okay. Here's my updates on the practitioner guides. I do have updates. Um, I just See. recorded a little video to go along with each one. So uh, those should be uploaded on the chaos YouTube uh, shortly. So we now have some additional additional video content and that will also um, that's also fed into the education program. So that will also be um, in the education materials. Excellent. Um, and we just recorded a podcast with the Sustain OSS podcast about the practitioner guides. And I'm writing in a blog post for opensource.net about the practitioner guides. So my focus has been on getting the word out about the practitioner guides. And then mm -hmm. um, the next one that I'm kind of working on is the security one. So that's that's the next one in, in my pipeline of course anyone else is welcome to work on any of the others or propose new ones okay any discussion on that i know yahoo said he could not be here today so um when you came in don 
we were talking about uh, just the ISO updates that there's a Chatham House Rules discussion in Slack. Um, and I don't know if you have any further updates. That was kind of, uh, we know that some conversations with Shane happened and stuff. But. Yeah, I don't have any any updates on that. Um, I think what, what Divya has posted in Slack is, you know, just trying to figure out when to have those Chatham House Rules meetings. But I, mm -hmm. you summarized it pretty well before I joined. Or yeah. as I, sorry, as I was joining. Yeah, so I mean, I guess uh, I assume that nobody who is here has any updates on any of the to do's for the ISOs. Since I mean, I've only I've been involved in it only to the extent that I'm aware of it at this point. All right, and then uh, metrics models in progress. I don't know if there are any. Got it. It's like. Uh, I feel like community fatigue was a thing we were working on at some point, like not that long ago. But I don't know. Um, make my screen a little bit wider here. It certainly has, uh, it is one of the ones that's in a being worked on code. Do we want to spend time working on, on this one since, um, we don't have other agenda items or should we look through them all and choose a different one to work on? Anybody have an opinion? Should I simply uh, suggest that we go forward and have another meeting in four weeks. <laughs> okay, Georg is thumbsing, uh, thumbing up uh, the suggestion of uh, continuing forward and uh, having another meeting in two weeks. Anyone want to fight to do the agenda here and work on a metric model? No. Okay. Well, uh, Nate swims in about an hour if you've got Peacock TV. Um, right now it's the women's 200, but uh, it'll be um, about an hour from now. I think he comes up. Okay. So I don't have Peacock TV for obvious uh, international reasons. Um, can somebody there post something be. in one of the channels, like the random channel or something? Somebody post something and let me know how he does because I'm super excited okay. about it. Yeah, no, I'm, uh, this is like, I, this is not the first heat. And like, I was looking at it on a sports show this morning and he's, there's like, it looks like, like the closer your heat is to the end, the closer, the better your time was in the preceding qualifier. And he's like in the last race or the second to last race. So, I mean, that's pretty exciting. Just to even get to participate in the like the you know the trials I, it's just it's so exciting just so exciting yeah no it's uh it's uh yeah very like in an hour I'll, I'll post something when uh when it happens i have peacock so i'm keeping it up there's probably a way to watch it in the uk but i have no idea what that is although maybe the uk doesn't care about america's swimming team <laughs> we, had, we had kind of a bad breakup <laughs> <laughs> I could, I could probably do something with a VPN to get access to something. Yeah. 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 Well, yeah, you know what they, you know what they call the, you know what they call the 4th of July, right? No. So, so all of my friends Tra here refer to it as Trader Day. Trader Day. <laughs> of yeah. course it is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, that's what we are. A bunch of traders. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, Thanks, everybody. Um, I will formally call this to a close and uh, see you all 
around online. Thank okay, you, so. See everybody. Bye. Bye.